73 here, your fishing friend. What I'm going to try to do is a little experiment and see if I can catch the, the Krampus tarpon uh, more than once a day. That's pretty good XP, so we'll find out. Here's what I'm going to use. The uh, reel out of the Krampus catcher pack, rod reel and, and line. The Krampus Hom 7 foot 3 inch rod, <coughs> 23 pound max. And you can't rig up more than 23 pounds according to the mission. Okay, the Hom reel, 3,500, 23 pounds. 008 braid, 23 pounds. And uh, Popper Santa's milk, one to a third ounce. Okay, so let's see what we can do. And we know back here is where they, let's see. That'd be okay. We know where the tarpon are. So that's why I go to start the exploratory mission there. So we'll see what happens. Bum, 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 bum. Bum, 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 bum. Okay, I'm out here on the end of the dock. I don't know how I got all here, out here all the way all of a sudden, but... <laughs> yeah. All I do is walk out the end of the dock. Go to the left and far left corner. And I'm aiming towards that tall tree there. Just as far as it'll cast. And if we cook this dude, it's a fight because we're here on the dock and we can't let it pull us around the boat. So we'll have to see what happens. Sometimes you catch it right off the bat, sometimes it takes a few casts. My dog got up and left. <laughs> But I hope this finds you safe and well. And I hope you have a happy new year. Your family as well. Be safe. Stay well. Ain't gonna catch it that close, I don't believe. Do do do. Do do do. Do, do, do. Do, 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 do. Come on, there we go. And I tried to give it one more click on a drag, but that puts it at max drag, and it'll it'll pop that lure off just like a blueberry on the end of a twig. So we don't want to do that. I've only got one more. So let's see what kind of XP we get out of this thing. And money. Really, I'm after money. <sighs> Use a lot of money doing this Christmas mission. Traveling around, traveling around, traveling around. Mainly to get my snowman hat. I think that's cool. And it can use a light, too. You can hook Santa's light on it. So you have a light. I'm a hat guy. I'm a hat guy in real life, too. <laughs> I got all kinds of hats. I got hats from people bring me, when people go on trips, you know, they bring you gifts back. Some people bring you t-shirts. Some people bring you uh, pottery and stuff like that. Every, all my friends know to bring me a hat. I don't even care if it's flat, stuffed, messed up, or what. Bring me a hat. I like hats. But I got hats from Alaska. I got hats from Jamaica. I got hats from a buddy of mine went on a, a carnival cruise, a month long cruise to Italy. Brought me a hat back off the cruise line. That's pretty cool. Uh, I've got insurance hats. I got Christian hats. I got fish, fishing planted hats, uh, hunting hats, baseball hats, University of Tennessee hats. That's the only university I had, I got. Almost lost it, didn't I? That was close. I got one hat that says CIA. And underneath it says Christians in Action. 
<laughs> but I got University of Tennessee football. I got University of Tennessee baseball hats. I like hats. And the uh, pink hats that uh, I think it's Farm Bureau put out, they were a cancer supporter, breast cancer supporter. And I, I used to buy those 20 at a time and give them away. They sold them for 10 bucks at the uh, offices, but I went to an office up here little north of my house and asked them if they had any of them left they said yeah and I said how many you got I don't know how many you want I said well if I buy 20 of them how much will you sell them to me for he said how about three dollars a piece I said how many you got I said well we got a lot I said well I'll take 20 of them and I'll probably come back and get 20 more 20 more 20 more and that's what I did I, I'd get 20 and give them away get 20 give them away but my wife is a cancer survivor, so I figured I could do what I could do to help their cause since they were supporting it. I don't like it when it does that, when it runs at me. That's kind of scary. First time I did this mission, when I first got this rig, it ran at me like that and I lost it because it went to running at me and then it goes fish loss low line tension I didn't I didn't particularly care for that I can't reel any faster than this rule let me reel Well, I know I started fishing at uh, Electra 5. So how long is it going to take to get this dude in? <laughs> do 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 do, 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 do. This is the biggest of the three Krampus fish. This is usually around 70 pounds. The uh, Krampus Payara is around between 50 and 60. And the eel is around, I don't know, 20 pounds or so. So hopefully this has got... Now you can catch the payata faster, cause it, it you can follow it, let it drag you around the boat. And you can catch it a lot easier than you can this one. But I want to see what this one pays on XP and money. I don't remember when I caught it the first time. That didn't stick in my head. But we'll see. If I can get it in, we'll see. <laughs> That's kind of an important part of it, isn't it? Yeah. We got it coming our way a little bit now. Keep on coming. Keep on coming. Keep on coming. Keep on coming. Hear me tap it on that right mouse button. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Here we go. Okay, what do we got here? That's only $3,900 for 72 pound fish? Hmm. I guess because it's Florida. Okay, the Payata will pay more. So. Let's go to Makumaku. See if I caught that more, as long as it took to catch it. Whew. So we'll go to Makumaku and see if we can catch the Payata more than once. 
Maku Maku. Gotta have a license. Okay, this is the rig we're going to use there. It comes out of the Krampus Catcher Back 2. It's a chocolate, chocolate bar 1110, 33 pound, the Chuckle Boom 6500, uh, 30.8 pound, 0.02 mono. Now, I don't know why it gives us the mono, but that's what it gives us 32 pound. Uh, the Christmas Treats Waggler, a 32 pound titanium point oh one one liter, a 10 odd hook, and candy cane bait. Okay, so let's go see what we can do. I would have thought that the uh, XP on that tarpon would be a whole lot more. Oh well. That's what I get for thinking. The way it bites, anyhow. To do half the game's wasted, or not wasted, but taken up by loading and unloading. Where you be? What we got here out of stocking all are here a <laughs> lump of coal okay that's one thing I never got for Christmas really do -do -do, do -do 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 -do. I'll put my headset on for this so I'll know when it's going to hit Do, do, do. Now I've got the leader set for max. But we'll see what happens when we get down here. So it just comes straight down between the island and the uh, shore. And this is where I catch my regular Piara. So now we're going to lead her up. I'll put my headset on so I can hear the ding. If I get a bite. There we go. And just get a reel out. Do, 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 do. And I just kind of throw it out here in the middle. Do, do, do. It don't really matter what the distance is. Will my light do me any good? Oh, yeah. You can see the bobber. I don't run really need to see the bobber on. I got that sight bobber, do I? There's just a ding. One ring a dingy. Do 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 like when I'm bobber fishing I put my hand over near the mouse and they never hit unless I take my hand away. <laughs> come on in, come on in. Come on in, come on in. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Here we go. There it is. Now, see, that's better. 55 pound fish is 16,000. Wow, that means if I can catch, can I catch 20 of them? Yeah, if I can catch 20 of those, whoa, that's $320,000. That would be awesome. didn't drag me very far either, did it? Did I have my anchor? Yeah, I have my anchor up. Okay, let's see if we can catch another one. You never know, unless you try. I 
I like that it came in and didn't drag me all over the place. But I knew, know a young lady that fishes here that she wants to fight. She wants it to fight. Uh, she, I, she doesn't like them to come in real fast like that. She wants to fight. I want to get it back in where I can get the bait back in the water. See if we can't catch another one. We've got seven players here. There's seven fishermen, however you want to say it. Do, 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 do. I'm going to lean back and relax y'all until I hear a ding. If you don't mind. If I hear a ding. Okay. Okie dokie. Do 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 Now if I can catch these like this, multiples, that's farming. Come on, take it. Please. Prove me, prove me, prove prove my supposition. If I catch another one, what I will do is I will stop this recording and then pick it back up again when I get a full net. If I get a full net of these and add it on to the end of this recording. We'll see. Hadn't caught another one yet. So. Come on, fish. If you want to take it, take it. Please. You may put me a smaller hook on there. See what that does. Hello, dear dragonfly. See, I didn't know there were dragonflies in the Amazon. I guess there is in this game. <laughs> Getting warm in here. I have to go turn that heater around. I got a pretty good tower heater. It blows, blows pretty good. Do, 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 do. Of course, I got this long sleeve shirt on too. That's not helping much. You gonna take it or not? Come on! Don't tease me. <laughs> So I think the, the best keeper full money wise I've ever had, a little over 101, 102,000, something like that, when I fished at Maran River and just kept uh, sorbent catfish, ripsaw catfish, uh, payata, uh, I forget what else. Anyhow, I kept fish that were $100, 93 to $100. Like that. Do, 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 do. Matt put a smaller hook on to get hit it again. Do, 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 do. Think a wheel, think a wheel. Yeah, the strike was done too early, I know. Do, do, do. do I have a seven? Yeah, there's a seven. Oh, you know what? I got a six though. 
I got a Barber 6. Ooh, that would make that, that money awesome. Should. Should make it around 20 grand. <laughs> I had that earn around 70 feet, didn't I? Let's stick with that. Doo -doo -doo. Oh, now I'm going to be back again. <sighs> I thought I could. Of course, the bobber hadn't gone anywhere yet, so. Are you going to take it, fish? Are you going to take it, fish? Da da da. Brum bum. Anticipation. Anticipation is making me wait. Keeping me way hey, 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 hey. Will you take my bait? Big old fish, will you take my bait? <laughs> okay. Lean back and relax. <sighs> P, 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 P. Practice, patience, persistence will produce. <laughs> do, 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 do. Do, 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 Come out of this long sleeve shirt. We're supposed to get a bunch of rain. We're talking about two to four inches next couple of days. That's a lot of rain. A lot of rain. Ah. Oh, my <laughs> fingers. <laughs> I think that's it. I think that's another one. If it is, that'll be just absolutely cool to be able to catch more than one in a day. If this is another one, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and stop the recording and uh, then I'll pick it back up when I'm done and show you the net and the money we'll see what happens oh, it's going to run this this is going to come, not going to come in as easy that other one did do, 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 do. at least I'm a little bit cooler come on in big boy big boy big girl whichever you are Whichever you are. See, there was sixteen thousand. If 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 I get what I should get with this barbless hook, this one should be around twenty thousand. Here we go. We'll find out. There it is. That one's only 15,000. I got less for the same size fish. I guess that hook didn't really matter, did it? Okay, what do you want? What do you want, buddy? What do you want, huh? You ready for a root beer? Okay, hold on just a minute. I gotta give my puppy a root beer. Yes, yes. 
there are important things. Yep, there you go, buddy. Okay, I'll be back in a little while with the rest of this recording. Okay, I'm back. You can see it's at night now. I am uh, right back here is where I was fishing earlier. I'm still at the island, but I moved down further. This is where uh, we've been used from fishing from this area. It's where we down here is where we've been throwing up this way, using that uh, six seventh ounce acid buzz bait and worm. So. I found a spot here that I'm fishing and I think I need one more to fill my net let me show you what I got here so far <coughs> I've got 18 <coughs> dollars. I never had that much cash in my net before now it's taken you can see what time it is. It's uh, almost midnight. So I've been fishing a long time. But this is just one of those experiments that uh, you give it a try. Now, also, uh, in the morning when I was fishing, it started raining. It was cloudy and it started raining. Uh, I fished two hours of, of uh, game time in the rain and they did not hit at all. I didn't catch a one. Oops. Got my lights off and my hat off. Uh, there we go. Uh, and they're slower at night. They seem to bite better in the morning. And it didn't... Uh, my buddy, Mizzou Fan Mike, is fishing for him also. He's filled his net up twice. Uh, since I told him about it, but he kept on fishing when I went to sleep. <laughs> and, and he has noticed that they do bite, that the bite rate is better in the morning. So we'll see what happens. I was hoping I could put 20 in, but it looks like 19 might fill my net. But we shall see. And this is it's slow. Uh, this is where patience is a virtue. They'll ding and ding and ding and ding, kind of like the uh, pike slasher when you're trying to catch it. Sometimes they just ding and go, and sometimes it just ding and ding and ding and ding before it finally takes the bait. We also found out that you can't buy any more <laughs> candy canes in the shop uh, in the uh, event the Krampus Kitcher Pack, they're not in there anymore. So, whatever you got is what you got. And we did get some in those uh, $99, I mean, 99 coin packs. They're not in there anymore either. So, what you got is what you got. And I'm just going to do this once. Uh, you can make farming make more money catching the uh, big catfish down at uh, Moran River in Bolivia and fill your net and roll over, fill your net and roll over, fill your net and roll over faster than you can do this. Uh, it wouldn't take, I don't know, I probably time-wise, if I disallow the two hours of rain, uh, 12, 19, let's say 20 hours so far of game time, which is five hours of real time. Well, during that same amount of time, you could fill your net, should be able to fill your net close to three times at Moran. Maybe, maybe take just a little longer than the five hours to fill your net at Moran, but you'd have about the same amount of money. 
you wind up with about between ninety and a hundred thousand dollars at Moran with if you don't keep the flat whiskers just keep the uh, gilded red tail uh, sorbin and uh, ripsaw now if you can if you use using bait other than the mole cricket weevil like large liver you'll catch uh, what are they call croakers you'll catch silver croakers they're worth about a hundred dollars a pound so if you have a net full of them you're doing pretty good but the uh, flat whiskers are only worth 25 to 30 dollars a pound they're not worth saving so I haven't been keeping them because I'm fishing for money <sighs> that said that's my rambling <laughs> uh, we gotta talk to him nicely so come on fish one more or if I get lucky it's only going to be like a 50 pounder I've got two new PB's while I've been doing this too I got one 61 pounder and then one 62 pounder and those I'll put pictures of on the uh, steam page my steam page which is Double Talk 73. So I'm going to shut up and just wait for the ding. Or I'll move back up the other end. Now, here I've got the, the leader set at 49 inches. At the other end, where it's uh, more open, I set the leader at max, which is 120, I think. But I'll show you the GPS coordinates of both buoys before I get done. That way you can set your buoys. You move one to the other. They they both seem to be not one faster than the other. Uh, there again, except in the morning. And I started off in a cloudy. Excuse me. And then went to bed last night. Uh, so after midnight, it changed the next day. And it was sunny, so they kept on hitting. But I also had to increase the time. Well, it was more than that because it started raining around 10, 10 or 11. And then I had to go to 4 p.m., which is almost six hours before the rain quit. So I lost six hours of fishing. But they weren't, they were not biting at all during the rain. Or whatever that's worth maybe they will for you they wouldn't for me they wouldn't for Mike Mizzou fan Mike gaming he does a lot of investigating and trying different stuff kind of like uh, RQC does just to see what'll work well, we're not even getting a ding here so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna move back up to the other location and see if I can't get something working. So let's get our motor started. And just go back up there. Because all I am, I'm just right beside the island. And it seems, oh, I must be on that. There we go. Must be on that stump. Okay, let's try it there now. Here we go, on that stump. <laughs> you can drive over it, but you can't back up through it. Okay. But the angle of your cast seems to be a, a factor of whether or not you're going to be lucky. See, there's that marker we're going to fish at. Excuse me. And I know it seems crazy, but Bill, you know, it's a video game, so things are different. I'm gonna put my put this down so we can take a, get a better shot of what we want. I want to be beside that log sticking up there, right there.
I want to go down beside it. Get my boat turned around here. Oh, don't scrape me, don't scrape me. And you've heard the term, the angle on the dangle. Well, it, it makes a difference. Put my anchor down and anchor up so I don't go anywhere. Put the rod, rod back in the water. And here I want to be max leader. Well, it's 205, okay. Although the depth finder says it's only five feet deep. <laughs> which is 60 inches which you can see a bobber's vertical and I found out they don't seem to like the light either they'll ding but they won't bite so whatever that's worth too <laughs> Here we go. And if you get close like that, hopefully you'll get it in before it decides to start taking you on a ride. 50 pound, 50 pound, 50 pound. 57, is that gonna do it? Ah, that filled her up. Well, that's still pretty, pretty good. So let's see what we got. We have 315857 dollars. 11.03. That's funny. Over by a pound. I'm almost willing to... Nah, it ain't gonna matter. Anyhow, it's full. And uh, that was my experiment. So let me show you the GPS locations. This is the one I'm at now. So it's uh, 329.47 and then 316.97. And you can watch the video again and uh, get that coordinate. Then this one down here is at 394.16. 275.01 and like I say right in this area here is where we park to cast that buzz bait back up this way and bring it across the top of the water and catch a lot of little little fish big fish arapaima a little bit of everything so there you go that's what I got for you I guess my motor's running again is that my motor nope Who's one of that? John Carl. Okay, that's my video. So, uh, remember, we will get through this together by the grace of God. Learn a little bit, pass it on, that's the fisherman's way. That's what I'm trying to do. So, this mission goes on, let's see when. Got ten more days that you can do this. If you've got candy canes. I've only got 75 left. So probably what I will do is start again in the morning and catch five, six, or seven and then roll over to the next morning because there's no sense in fishing uh, 24 hours to fill your net. Just do it for fun. Okay. And have fun. But uh, P, 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 P. This time for sure. Practice, patience, persistence will produce. Okay, so uh, God bless you and your family. Please have a happy new year. Be safe, be well. Take care of yourself, take care of your family. 
and uh, I guess I will catch you later. So, uh, Double Talk 73, your fishing friend saying, y'all come back now, you hear?